This video is on state regulations for the Environmental Legal Research course. State and federal regulations are similar in a number of ways. States have their own version of the Administrative Procedures Act, which sets out, eight, sets out how agencies can promulgate rules and how members of the public can present data, views, or arguments on the proposed regulations. Most states publish new regulations in chronological order in a register and in a subject arrangement as an administrative code. States use varying terminology for their registers, the place they publish new or proposed regulations. Some examples include the California Regulatory Notice Register, Baldwin's Ohio Monthly Record, and the, Ohio, and the Oregon Bulletin. Unlike the Federal Register, which is published every business day, state registers can be published weekly or biweekly or monthly. States also have a variety of names for their administrative codes, the topical arrangement of their current regulations. Some examples include the Code of Colorado Regulations, the Utah Administrative Code, the Code of Vermont Rules, and the official compilation Rules and Regulations of the State of Tennessee. Most administrative codes and registers are available from major legal vendors such as Lexis, Westlaw, and Bloomberg Law. There can be both official and unofficial publications of state regulations, and some have confusing names. The Blue Book Table 1 is the best source of the actual title of the official state administrative code or register. There are also some that may have different names on different platforms, so check carefully to be sure you are searching or reading the resource you want, especially when dealing with a jurisdiction you're unfamiliar with or new to. Some states' administrative codes and registers are published exclusively, electro ele exclusively electronically, while others are published electronically as a courtesy, like the Code of Massachusetts regulations. This convenient-to-use free version of the CMR is available online through the Massachusetts Trial Court Libraries. But only the print version is official. It's published in loosely format so that individual pages are replaced when regulations change. And when you're citing to a CMR, be sure and give the date of the page that the section you want to talk about is printed on, rather than the date of the binder itself.